In this video, you're gonna find out how to get the first job on Upwork. You see, getting the first job on Upwork is like being this character in the movie 40 year old virgin. You're kind of old and experienced in your craft, but at the same time, you're just a complete newbie. But the good news for you is that in that movie, the guy ended up scoring. So get your protection ready and let's rub and roll. She'd be like, oh, me so horny, me love you long time. If you haven't completed something before, I usually gonna link to other videos so you can check out other instructions on how to make things work. So the first thing you want to do to actually land the job is you want to have your profile approved. Now, surprise, surprise, it needs to be done first. So to get your profile approved, you can watch another video that I made that should be appearing here as a card. If you're watching on YouTube, if you're watching on Facebook or somewhere else, then I'm gonna always link to the YouTube version so you can see those cards and links to other videos. So now that your profile is approved, then you want to improve this profile. In fact, you want to boost this profile so much so that you're gonna basically look better than other people out there. So to look better than the others, you want to implement few simple steps in there just to show that your profile is of a better quality. You want to make a video on your profile. You want to add a high quality picture in, in, in which you basically have an eye contact with the person without too much noise at the background, in the background. So in case there is too much noise, you want to get rid of that. You want to have a good description and this is how you boost your profile. There are a few other steps if you haven't seen that video on boosting your Upwork profile and making sure that it's actually the best across other competitors in your niche, then you can check this other video. It should be appearing here as well. That's a video on how to boost your Upwork profile. So now we have your profile approved. You have your profile optimized to be better than all the other profiles on Upwork. And now it's time to send a proposal. And here is a hard thing because when you don't have any reviews yet, when you basically have no customer work in the past, then it's going to be much harder for you to actually get that first job because people don't see that you have any success score, you don't have any reviews. So there is a solution to that. You can do either of three things. The first thing you can do is you can switch your payroll from another person that you're working with to Upwork. So basically the way this works is that they hire you on Upwork instead of paying you directly like they used to so that they can give you a review. So that's the first method. The second method is to partner up with another freelancer and ask them whether you could use their portfolio so you can pimp up your portfolio because as you're starting out, you might not have any portfolio. So that's already gonna help you. And the third method is to put the step in the door and offer to do some work for free when you're starting out just to get the review. So people you're sending proposals to, they're gonna see that you're really a hustler, you are willing to work for free. So you can just work for an hour or two for free, especially if you're in IT, that's gonna work. This method is gonna work because there is no high rotation of people that companies hire. So you can think about this as of hiring an IT guy they would just stay with that person pretty much forever because it's so much more work to change an IT person versus just staying with the person that they are with already. So that's why the foot in the door method works. So as you can see, there are three different methods of approaching this, but why are we actually using those methods? Because at the beginning, when you're starting out, landing the first job is kind of like this vicious circle. You don't have reviews, you don't have portfolio, and you don't have any client work to show to others. You don't have a success score. So it's a catch-22. It's a vicious circle because nobody wants to hire you because you have no experience. It's kind of like handing your CVs to companies and they all ask you about experience, but you don't have that experience. So on Upwork, it's even if you have some experience from before, but you don't have any rating, then you are basically a newbie. So you don't want to come across as one and you want to make sure that 
you have that portfolio, you have those reviews, and this gonna help you massively landing that first job. So I made another video where I'm explaining to you step by step how to put your foot in the door and how to get clients on Upwork even if you don't have a portfolio. So you can check this video here. Here is a card that should be appearing and you should be able to see that video. There. Now that you already have some reviews, some portfolio, you're ready to start sending actual proposals and here are two things to get those jobs. The first thing is you want to have the best proposal. So to have the best proposal, what you want to do is you want to address the person you are sending this proposal to by their name and you want to really tap on their problem. You don't want to talk too much about yourself. You want to talk specifically about them and their problem. Now, I made another video in which I'm explaining to you exactly how to write a proposal and in this video I am even giving you a sample that you can copy. So this sample is in the description of that other video so you can check this video here. After watching this other video you're gonna find out how to write the best proposal that is the most appealing. But here is the thing, it's not just about being the best, it's also about being the first one. So how can you be the first one to send the proposal? And by the way, why is this important? Because a lot of customers are like, I want it now. I just want to choose the first person that applied. So how do you make yourself first? How do you put your proposal as the very first one? To do that, you want to have notifications on your phone whenever there is a new job posted within your category. So. This is quite easy to set this up. You just need an app that is an RSS feed reader. So I explain it in another video step by step how to make this work. So you can check this video here. It explains to you how to find the RSS code that you can paste in the app to get notifications whenever there is a job from your category. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna apply to jobs specifically from your category. You just want to apply to those that you are specialized in because your profile is optimized for those jobs. And this is pretty much it. If you follow those steps and watch those other videos that I mentioned to you, you're gonna get this first job landed. I can guarantee that to you. But the problem with Upwork and all those funnels is that those things, they do change a lot and there are a lot of updates so make sure that you gonna subscribe because i'm gonna be putting all new videos on how to make this funnel work so it's simple just click on subscribe button and you're gonna get notified whenever i'm posting new videos whenever there is some changes on the upward funnel the upward funnel and changes within other funnels that i'm sharing with you on youtube good luck and make sure to watch other videos from those cards that I was referring to.